if you look at this guideline, it's in a way of uh, when you create your password, what, in, what kind of requirements it needs to have in order to have a strong password. The problem with this is this is really outdated if you look at a lot of um, platform or code that people created because um, in the code, most time the developers, they put all these things that we talk about it in, the, uh, um, in these guidelines in it. So when you create an account on the platform, they will ask you to make a stronger password or you have different kind of way to protect it and it's a good thing but sometimes some company they don't have that and they can use these guidelines to make sure that the people that work there or the people that they work with or the people that use their system that they follow the guidelines and what you need to do is when you go into contact with someone you say you respect our guidelines or when you have an employee and you say hey listen when you work for us you need to follow these guidelines or other things when you have user use your platform you can say hey you need to follow these password guidelines most people think this is really difficult but it's not it's just a set of rules how to create your password but most time if you are using an advanced system or modern system the developer have they have this type of things in the system to protect the system so you don't have to worry about this that's why a lot of people don't use this but if you have question about this, what you can do is just press the link in the description, go in Discord and ask me directly. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. I will see you in the next video.